council member representing this community in particular, Chinatown and the Lower East Side. And what we've been advocating for decades is to build more affordable housing. The last affordable housing building that was built in this community was Confucius Plaza. Think about that. More than three decades of this community asking, pleading, saying, we want more affordable housing for our seniors, for our immigrant communities, and we've got nothing. And so with this new administration, we've been advocating to keep this community sound and protected. Uh, in protection, I mean keeping this affordable, which we haven't seen in the past eight years. And so we've been advocating to stop the jail and to make sure that our mayor listens to us. And recently over the weekend, uh, the mayor has. Uh, he told me, his team told me that the 231 Grand Street shelter will now move forward. And as many of you, and as many of you heard, the East Broadway shelter also isn't moving over. We thank him for listening. We thank him for working with us, but we really need to continue this conversation. This is not a concession for the mega jail. This is not a concession for the lack of affordable housing. Uh, yesterday, elected officials were at City Hall rallying to build more affordable housing through conversion of hotel use. That's what we can do for this community. And so I call on our elected officials on the state level to pass that legislation to make sure that we can build true affordable units for this community and for the whole city. Thank you. Chris Martin.